Hello, hope you're doing good. Welcome to my eComposer Shopify product page builder tutorial. If you don't have a Shopify account as yet, I'll be leaving a link in the description that you can use to access their free trial period. Once you have created your account, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Once on your dashboard, I want you to go over to the left hand menu option and select apps. Then from there, you're going to tap on all recommended apps and you're going to tap on Shopify App Store. After doing that, you will be redirected to the Shopify App Store and you're going to type in eComposer in the search bar and you're going to be led to a page just like this and you're going to tap on install. And with eComposer landing page builder, you'll be able to set one live page so you can tap on install then you're going to be redirected to a new page on this new page you're going to tap on install once more then you'll be redirected to the ecomposer dashboard and you're just going to tap on next verify the theme that you're using select next then like how we'd like to create a product page we're going to select product if it was a case that you would like to create a landing page a home page or a collection page you could select any one of those options and you're just going to tap on select template after tapping on select template you can scroll down and you can see numerous templates that you can choose from now let's say for example i would like to use this template right here all i would need to do is tap on select after you have selected the template of your choosing you're going to tap on next then you can give the template a name and you can also type in the template slug after doing that you will tap on start building once you have tapped on start building you are going to select insert and you are going to be redirected to the ecomposer dashboard it is going to automatically populate the page with your product and you can also see the product price and with ecomposer it is quite easy to edit anything that you would like to change you can tap on the section so for example, I could tap right here and I could change the product that is chosen by going over to the left hand menu option and tapping on change. You could do that. You could also tap on design. And for example, you could increase or decrease the width. Another thing that you can also do by scrolling down, we could edit this section again. We could tap right there and you could edit the text if you want. You can also edit each section by tapping on it. If you would like to change these images, you could do that. It's as easy as that. Tap on the section you want to edit, then type in whatever you want. Tap on the image you'd like to replace, then go over to the left hand menu option and you can replace it. And if it is a case that you would like to add text, video, slider, or anything at all to the page, you can tap on elements in the top left hand corner tap on basic and you can see the basic elements whether it is a countdown timer or anything at all you can add it right there if it is something related to Shopify for example a product contact form newsletter or anything like that you can select Shopify and you can drag and place it on your page once you're finished and it is to your liking you're just going to tap on publish in the top right hand corner after selecting publish you're going to tap on save and publish then after tapping on save and publish you'll just give it a few seconds and if we tap on view you can see how our product page looks right now and this is it hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button